Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. Today we're gonna to be doing a really fun craft and we're gonna be making, or I'm gonna be showing you guys how to make Suncatcher stickers. If you don't know what a Suncatcher sticker is, it is a window decal that you can put in a window that receives direct sunlight. And when the sunlight filters through the sticker, it creates rainbows in your room. So there are two different versions of this that you can make. This one requires water to stick to the window. This one is actually just like a normal sticker. So it has a backing that you peel and then it is sticky on the actual sun catcher part. So you can just stick it right in your window without having to use water. So hopefully you can kind of see that. And this is the one I'm gonna show you guys how to make today. Okay, I'm going to show you what it looks like on my canvas for cutting. We have all of my orange pumpkins and then we have that black backing, which will be the holographic sun catcher part. So to create that, I select all the pumpkins and I go to offset. You can play around with this um, depending on how thick you want the holographic sun catcher part to be, but just make sure there's enough so there is sun catcher parts all around the image. Once we click OK, you're going to see these white sections. We do not want that because the Cricut will actually cut those out. So I'm gonna be taking this circle and actually putting that over the white sections and then I'm going to send it to the back. And you're going to do this for each pumpkin so that way we do not have those white sections. Once you do that, you'll see your circles, you'll see your pumpkin. We're going to select all of those and then weld them together so it is one layer. When we are cutting the pumpkin part out on the holographic vinyl, turn off that backing layer and vice versa whenever you cut out the sun catcher backing because um, we want to cut them out separately. Okay, so now that I have weeded out all of the excess for this pumpkin, um, something that you can do if you're doing something like this that requires a lot of weeding is you can get one of these little tools to kind of hold onto. So once you're weeding, you can just stick it in here. It's a lot easier and faster, but because this pumpkin was really simple, um, I didn't need to use this, but we are now ready to actually cut out the rainbow backing and put this on. So on both the vinyl and the rainbow backing, um, you want it shiny side or like design side up. So I applied tape to just the bottom and the top just to make sure it stays in place. So if your Cricut mat is not super sticky anymore, you don't have your 
vinyl or your rainbow backing just moving around because we want nice clean lines. So I'm just applying some tape to the top and bottom. And now we're ready to run this through the Cricut. I'm going to try cutting it on poster board and see if that cuts all the way through. But your cut settings are going to vary. Um, whenever I had to cut the, whenever I was cutting the pumpkin, I had to change my settings multiple times because it was not cutting all the way through. Um, so I ended up having to cut this on vinyl plus and then cardboard and then cardboard plus. So I think something's going on with my Cricut machine. So cut settings are really going to vary. Just play around with it and see which one works best for you. So I probably could have done poster board plus or even a little bit heavier because it's not coming out very well. Okay, I got it. So yeah, those ones may be a little bit harder to get out, but here's our little pumpkin backing. So now I'm gonna show you guys how I get this onto this and then we'll peel it and I'll show you guys what it looks like once we're done. But that's it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and learning how to make Suncatcher stickers. If you have any more questions, definitely leave those down in the comment section below. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And if you ever follow any of my tutorials, you can tag me over on Instagram or TikTok at Tabs Art Shop. And I would love to see it and share it on my page. But that's it. I will see you guys in my next video very soon. Bye.